Good evening and welcome to tonight's uh, SBC News. The Family Department is emphasizing the need to establish a comprehensive structure to minimize negative impact on families when they separate, especially on children. The department has started discussions with its partners, including the NCC, Family Tribunal and Social Affairs, to improve the situation in instances where two parents have separated. Last year's statistics have shown that fathers are the ones who are the most affected when it comes to legal decisions where they are sometimes deprived from seeing their children. The discussion on family separation mediation intends to address these grey areas and weaknesses to ensure the best interest of the child and the satisfaction of all other parties. The healthcare agency has received new equipment to help patients who require rehabilitation therapy, especially those suffering from persistent uh, negative effects of uh, COVID-19. Amongst the donations were wheelchairs, including those uh, that uh, come with a potty, and therapy equipment uh, for all parts of the body. There are also some equipment which will be used at the family hospital at uh, Perseverance for patients with respiratory problems. The donation comes to a total of 110,000 rupees. It is a sum that the Seychelles Revenue Commission has been able to put together with the help of Len Marine and the sum it received from its participation in the SBC's office choir competition. The Commissioner-General of the SRC, Veronique Emini, says COVID-19 sufferers are very close to the heart of the staff of the SRC. The donation is uh, principally for COVID patients, uh, what we call the long haulers, those suffering from uh, um, lung infection, for example, and who requires uh, therapy. So it was important for us to um, um, make that donation towards uh, this cause because uh, we have staff employees of ours who've been admitted at the family hospital with COVID. We've had family cast away. So it's a cause a little bit close to our heart, if I may use uh, that term, um, for SRC, the staff management, and even for the board as well. The uh, delegation, including the CEO of uh, the LWMA, the CEO for Infrastructure and uh, District Authorities, made a visit uh, to La Digue to see the drainage project that, that was completed last year. The main issue brought forward was that uh, the drainage is not being maintained well, and uh, together they discussed on how to go forward and who will be responsible to clean different uh, drains on La Digue to avoid future flooding during heavy rainfall. The National Assembly has approved amendments in the law so as to abolish the Tertiary Education Commission or TEC. Presenting the bill, Education Minister Justin Valentin says since the law came into force in 2012, for tech uh, to recommend policies and plan to advance the tertiary education center, tech has had difficulties in establishing itself. And the line separating the functions of tech from that of the education department was not clear. So there have been instances of duplication of functions between the two and the Seychelles Qualification Authority, the SQA. So the government, in uh, consultation with the parties concerned, has taken the decision to repartition tax functions to the SQA and the Department of Education. And those are our main stories so far this Wednesday evening. Join us again at 8. Bye for now.